Hundreds of rescue workers and volunteers near Bangladesh's capital are still searching. They're looking for survivors under the rubble of an eight-story building on the outskirts of Dhaka that collapsed on Wednesday. They can hear calls for help. Okay. Save us, brother. I beg you. I want to live. It's so painful here. So painful. I have two little children. Witnesses say hundreds may still be trapped. Thousands of family members have gathered at the site, where more than 170 people have been killed and another 1,000 injured. Emergency workers have so far pulled out hundreds alive. But people in the capital have protested about the slow pace of the rescue effort. The building housed five garment factories. Police say the owners ignored warnings to evacuate the building when cracks were noticed on Tuesday. The owners are now reportedly in hiding. The garment industry is a driver of Bangladesh's economy, but has a terrible safety record. Last November, a fire at a factory in Dhaka killed 111 people. The government has announced a national day of mourning. The number of dead in this latest incident already makes it Bangladesh's worst industrial disaster. The hope now is that this number will not grow. Rodri Davis, Al Jazeera.